At least it's a competitive Warsong Gulch. I'll give it that. And I call this a Warsong Gulch because it is. We all know it. I know it. You know it. It's fucking Warsong Gulch, guys. This isn't Twin Peaks. So many priests. I just saw three mind games on the poor fucking flag carrier. We're gonna probably death grip him back. Uh, oof. All of the cooldowns. Hold on. Oh, I'm panicking. Like, I have so many buttons, I don't even know what to press. There we are. Probably go on the healers, though. There we go. Everyone's falling. Could still probably focus the healers. Let's get Necrotic on. Go on the Priest here. Ooh, I don't have Necrotic on my normal key binding. Very awkward, very awkward. Oh, we did capture the flag. Very nice. Start death striking just for some health. Mainly because I don't think there's a healer here. My pet did die, so let's resummon that. We'll use Death Strike or Death Wish here anyway. Death Pact, Death Wish, whatever the fuck it's called. It actually looks exactly the same as Death Wish, so maybe that's why I called it that. Anyway. Join this in the middle of it, so go figure. Uh, here's my talents, guys. If you guys want to copy those, feel free to do so. Nothing really amazing there, talent-wise. And it has been a little bit since I've played on Holy Death Knights, so... Excuse me if I'm pressing the wrong buttons, <laughs> like AMS, when I don't even need it. Like AMS, or just really panicking when I don't know where my burst is. Um, pretty much every time i played Unholy slash Death Knight, it's always more or less been as a Frosty case, so... Yeah, used to, really used to Frost. Uh, the main reason, of course, I want Frost to be good, but we're, 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 I don't, I don't know. Frost is how it is, man. Do I suicide here and just... Okay, I, I, like, no choice, I guess. Didn't mean to fall down there. Uh, let's stun. Get all of our cooldowns going again. Cooldowns, cooldowns. We'll go, we'll go on the healer. Flag carrier's dead, man. If we kill the healer, flag carrier dies fast. Easy cap. I believe, Warlock, I believe. Go get him 50k health, Andy. Damn. So it looks like it might be a draw for the entire battleground, but again, we'll see. One of the best things about Unholy, though, is the fact that I pretty much our cooldowns are up every two minutes if you want to count Abomination Limb, but it's like one and a half minute not counting Abomination Limb. And again, I am slightly undergeared to all of my characters. If you see me at max level, guys, I'm most likely hovering around the 158 item level. Uh, nothing too great, nothing amazing, but it is just, it is what it is, man. We simply have to outskill them instead of outgear them, since we're so undergeared. And it shouldn't be too hard to be honest, but yeah, we'll see. Definitely gonna sit near our healers though. Kind of have to be relying on those guys. Because Death Knights have no fucking healing. Wowie. Anyway, on the mage. Let's slow him, get dots up, get our abomination up. Trinket that. Oh, I need to bind my trinket. Just kidding, I don't have a on-use trinket. Alright, more cooldowns. As I grip everyone towards the objective, ah, uh, yes. A genius plan. Kind of cooldowns on this guy. We'll use Abomination here, too. As you can see, his health is just kind of melting as I don't have a pet, Lamau. I feel like my pet dies so often. There's almost nothing I can do about it. God, Necrotic just fucks Disc Priest, man. I love it. It's really so strong against Discs. That makes me want to play Unholy, like in Arena right now, because I think Disc Priest are like the most played healer right now in Arena. But Necrotic just, it just screws them over so much. Minus Storm Rage pre-made. Holy shit. <laughs> One, two... And what is it? Everyone except me and two others? So, seven people from... <laughs> seven people from Storm Rage. Is it a pre-made from a guild, though? SDS. Oh, it actually is. Okay. Well, what are the odds? Are we getting a guild pre-made? Um, I'm not complaining, to be honest. I mean, I, I would be if the guild was bad, but the guild seems to be decent. I mean, most of the people from the guild tend to be a little geared. Do I even help here? I, I'm helping. I threw my dot up. I did my job. Alright, on to this guy. 
slow him, throw a dot on him. I guess I'll use Lichborn. Why not? Really feel like it was overkill on cooldowns there, but I have them up so often. It's like kind of, kind of just like why not? I feel like eventually they're gonna get the flag past middle. It's because they're trying to be so consistent about it. At least like picking up the flag constantly. Where will you go, Druid? And we stun. All right, no, no way you live past this. There's just no way. Throw our death coil, necrotic strike here, death grip him back. Or necrotics, throw up dots again. Good luck, buddy. Good luck. Did you not have the flag? Did he? Did he drop it? What? He must have dropped it. I did not see him drop it. As a no, no, that's really confusing. I swear to God, he had the flag. You, you fool! This is mine. Don't you see how geared I am? Don't you see my item level? I obviously deserve this. You're not even in the pre-made either. Come on, man. Nice mount, though. I'll give you that. <laughs> he doesn't seem too happy. He's literally standing on the berserking buff now, refusing to move. As I would as well. Hopefully healer doesn't show up. We'll use Apocalypse here. There's the healer. So we use more cooldowns. Ooh, the Death Knight did a good bit of damage there. I don't know. I feel like for some reason, maybe maybe it's because I'm undergeared, guys. But whenever a tank hits me, they actually do damage. And it's mildly terrifying every time. Even in Arena too. I think I did Arena on... God, what character was it on? I think it was my Shaman, and I was so undergeared that one... It was essentially one Shadow Strike and Eviscerate did half of my health. And then I also went up against the Vengeance Demon Hunter, and uh, the Vengeance Demon Hunter more or less <laughs> was able to... Because I feel like tanks really shouldn't be able to, like, I don't know, do consistent damage. Unless you're a prod pally, then you can do whatever the fuck you want, because you're just an ultimate Chad. But... Vengeance Demon Hunter was going against it. He did a surprising amount of damage, and he constantly got my health, like, below half. So, I'm not sure if they buffed tanks damage or what, but maybe maybe it's just the undergeared part. How geared is this monk? Not geared at all. I'm not sure if mean this just the monk will be able to do this. As long, if, like, we have a healer, we'll be able to do it, but I really hope a healer stayed with the flag carry. He is a geared death knight, though, so I'm going to death grip this guy over here. Come here, baby! <laughs> uh, you poor guy. Uh, whatever. There we go. Start stacking necrotics. Just what I know how to do. The only thing I know how to do. Stack Necrotics and watch the Flag Carrier die. There we are, guys. The ultimate hack. The ultimate hack in this bursty meta. To simply use Necrotic Strike. It's as simple as that. It's actually, like, it, it's always surprising to me how much Necrotic Strike just completely fucks over, like, healers. It's definitely stronger against Disc Priests, just because of how Absorbs work. Because a lot of their damage is just applied very gradually over time through offensive spells. One of these days, Pally, I swear. I swear, I, I might not seem like a threat ever, but when I get cooldowns up, I swear to God, man. I swear to God. God, my pet's almost dead. That bubble? No. I feel like my pet does more damage than me. Which is, I don't know, I guess... Purposely applied. We not cap the flag. Go, go get him, Moonrise. Fuck, so close, man. So close. Is this really gonna be a draw? It's, it's actually gonna be a draw, guys. It's always the mage that picks up the flag, too. I don't, he, he's such a bold soul. I don't know why. <laughs> why, why let the undergeared mage carry the flag? 
We're gonna death grip as soon as we get all of our cooldowns back. No. Alright, death grip. Abomination limb. Stun. Unholy blight. Uh, where's my walk thing? My walk thing, guys. Where is it? Alright. Whatever. That didn't go as planned. Where's my Wraith Walk? Okay, there it is. It's not Wraith Walk, fucking whatever this is. Death's Advance. It's like Walmart Wraith Walk, essentially, since we have to spec into Wraith Walk now. Which, if, if you ask me, guys, doesn't make any sense. Oh, that Death Strike healing never gets old. <laughs> it's like I use it. I use Death Strike just to pretend I'm a little bit tankier than anything, but it, it never does anything. I actually want to see how much healing. Death Strike does an average of 2,000 healing. Uh, I don't think that's worth it. At most abilities hit more than 2,000 now. Like, if you're even the slightest bit geared, 2,000 healing is... God, nothing. It's a tenth of my health. Not even a tenth of my health. It's like a twelfth mathemat mathematically, guys. Fucking genius here. Oh my god, they won. Well, GG, man. You deserve it, Horde. You deserve it. That was a... That was probably the sweatiest fucking capture the flag I have ever been a part of. So, I can't even be mad, man. I can't even be mad. Thanks for watching. Did not know what I was signing up for in the middle of a seven fucking man pre-made, but hey. <laughs> Last thing I expected was to lose, but we are Alliance, so you can never be too surprised with those fuckers. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, description, bell thing, Twitch, Twitter, all of that shit, as always. Until next time, guys, take it easy. Thanks for watching.